I really felt like diving deep into all the crimes and damages that superheroes have caused, but I want to focus on one hero in particular, Deadpool. And if we're talking like real menace to society, he is the real menace. So I want to find out what happens if Deadpool was actually charged for his crimes. Did I leave the stove on? So I want to start with the infamous pizza scene, Deadpool 1. Ah, there he is. What a guy. The f*** you doing in my crib? Oh my god. Deadpool 1 had like the best writing. I will shoot your fucking cat. But at this point, when Deadpool points the gun at the other guy and takes this dude's pizza, we can consider that first degree burglary. And you can serve up to five plus years in prison. How do you start off a movie already just getting sentences like this? Pizza guy is a creep. But hey, Deadpool takes charge at some point here. Yep, there we go. Yeah, that's another crime here. Also this part. Nice little... Uh, so with that assault, that can be considered as menacing, which can get you up to one year in prison, but also the whole sexual assault. Yeah, we were all like laughing in the theaters about that, but hey, that is six months in prison. But also we got theft too, because he walks out with the pizza. That is another additional six months in prison. We're starting off pretty strong. And throughout this video, we'll be seeing a lot more crimes and some pretty crazy ones too, committed by Mr. Deadpool himself. As we move on to our next clip, where Wade finally meets Vanessa for the first time. Yeah, no, I did not realize she had short hair. Tight. Wait, what's tight? Huh? Vanessa. Hi. I mean, what? I, I really just feel like I'm in the scene. I did that. <gasps> Wait. <laughs> this guy. He doesn't have any speaking lines. Fuck. You best apologize before. <sighs> yeah. That. Yeah, that's definitely some sort of crime, right? I was molested. Me too. Oh, okay, yeah, that line right there. This is their way of flirting, but it's considered patronizing and patronizing a prostitute, which Vanessa is at this current point. And that can equal six months in prison, as well as our first fine, a thousand dollar fine for that, which I mean, like I said, they're, they're flirting, even though it's probably something you shouldn't do. He's damn near mocking her. But now we finally have Deadpool in his red suit. The first time we get to see it. 27.50. I, I never carry wallet while I'm working. Ruins the lines of my suit. Oh. But uh, how about, uh, Crisp high five. Hey, payments and high five is a crime. Well, you know, I mean, it's, it's just not legal. Like at least give this guy some pocket lint, you know? Maybe maybe like a Slim Jim or something. But that is theft of service. That can equal up to $4,000 in fines as well as six months in prison. If someone actually runs out of your taxi, they're in pretty big trouble. And no lie, I actually enjoy reliving the whole moments of Deadpool. Like dude, just this scene alone was so Great, ah, oh, I just hit my hand. Oh, this movie was so hard. But what else goes hard is the fact that Deadpool takes out this entire caravan of enemies. Uh-huh, and there's a lot of enemies. How do you land so perfectly inside this window? I need a kill count. All the people who die here, do they deserve it? I mean, they are bad guys, but <laughs> on the highway, it's kind of fucked. I'm looking for Oh, oh my God, that was- Have you seen this man? <laughs> Wait, guy on the bike. Oh, guy on the bike, of course. Yankee, Yankee. And we, we lose the drive pretty much. Oh my God. <laughs> okay, wait, Deadpool didn't kill that guy. He definitely killed a dude on the bike though. For this to even happen in real life, is this even possible? Oh my God. <laughs> when I first saw this in theaters, I was actually mind blown. Jaw has droppeth. Hey, <laughs> dude gives him an actual wedgie. The kill count is pretty high already. Did you like the video? Yep. Oh yeah, no. <laughs> oh my God, it's so graphic. And splat. So we have first degree murder six times, which does equal out to six life sentences, Wade. Okay, I hope you know that. But just as a reference for all the other damages caused, this is just a hypothetical number, but the number can go up to 150 years in prison. But as we all know, the chaos does not stop there. Hi, I'm here. No, yeah, we got like a scene where you know, they're on this bridge and Deadpool only has a certain amount of bullets. I only have 12 bullets, so you're gonna have to oh, share. Keep that number in mind. Let's count them down. <laughs> oh, he's actually missing shot. I don't remember that. Seven. <laughs> Jeez. Oh. Someone's not counting. Yep. Six. Right now he's on his fourth kill. Five and six. Seven. And of course, Deadpool had to just pop out like he's playing Call of Duty to get this triple collat. That is eight, nine, and ten, baby. <laughs> Yeah, uh, let's be serious though, okay? 10 first degree murders, 10 life sentences added to the list. But after an action packed day, you know, we gotta go to the bar for some drinks to rehydrate. I'm so thirsty right now. And no, Deadpool asking for a isn't considered as a crime. I mean, they're just buddy buddy joking around. But right here, Buck, please, and tell him it's from Booth. 
little foreplay. Mm -hmm. Even the wording there. His intent was to incite a whole fight. Thank you, Buck, for making things interesting while we rehydrate. Inciting a fight that is one year in prison. But of course, big bad guy Francis shows up. We, we don't really like Francis. He's kind of weird and ugly and stuff. Kind of responsible for giving Deadpool his powers. If I were a 200 pound sack of assholes named Francis, where would I hide? In a bigger asshole? Essentially, Deadpool, this entire scene is just going to end up bullying the hell out of Francis. Like, look at this. Like, he's literally like on the playground right now. Francis, you good? Not after this. <laughs> it's some well-deserved revenge, you know? But the thing is, that is aggravated assault, which is 10 years in prison. Also, it should be a crime to look this ugly, God. But on a more serious note, that is attempted murder, which is an additional 15 years in prison. So Wade, you're you're at a high number right now. I hope you're keeping track. Use your powers for good. That's not <laughs> the best scene. Unfortunately, Francis does end up playing a ninja vanish. Like this idiot should be paying more attention, you know? Iconic pose though and scene. Just <laughs> he pulled a Macaulay Culkin there. But he becomes really angry at Colossus, you know? And takes out all of his anger on him, his big head, and even his nice shiny nuts. Oh, yeah, dude, I felt that down my spine. And he, he just keeps going. <laughs> but all that anger focused at Colossus will land Wade some pain. But also an assault charge, which is one year in prison. Get it, you guys are buddy buddy, but also don't hit your buddy buddy in the the nuts nuts just like deadpool he has an origin story he came from nuts like you know get it because yeah he was pretty much tortured by francis earlier on which is how he got his powers so when francis goes to take his nice little piss break deadpool does act in self-defense but it was actually kind of fucked up to see him suffer like this ah oh, perfect catch but right about here is where he uses his self-defense that would turn on him This could be 20 plus years in prison, as well as $250,000 in fines, because this is considered arson. But it gave us a pretty devilish, fiery fight scene with Francis and Deadpool for the first time. I really thought Wade had this shit in the bag. This is Deadpool fighting in self-defense, so there's no crimes happening here. Deserved, deserved. <laughs> No! In Wade's attempts to find Francis, he goes on a bit of a killing spree. It turns out that Deadpool actually ends up killing around 50 people here, which includes some torture. It tortures uh, 10 years in prison. There's also some first degree burglaries, that about, about 10 of them, which can equal out to up to 50 years in prison. He's currently destroying evidence here in the laundromat. Um, that's also not good. Covering up evidence is definitely six plus months in prison. Some extortion here, and it, it occurs about five times or so. That is an additional five years in prison, and then it gets even worse. Worse. All together with all the kills, 49 first degree murders as he's literally doing it in style. Oh, and this scene, this scene's perfect, but we get an additional 980 plus years in prison. But I always love the scene because we can pretty much see his costume evolved and a pretty cool theme song that is just like... <laughs> this is confusing. Who mixed this? But by the end of the movie, we finally catch up to Francis, the goddamn menace of the film. If anything, he deserved what he got. What's my name? Ooh, I'm gonna fucking spell it out for you. As these two characters sit in the craziest missionary position I've ever seen in a film, okay? Imagine dying this way, just looking up at this fucker. Did you really think there was a kill? My heart actually dropped here hearing this from him. Uh -oh. He's kind of stuck like this forever. No! Which leads Deadpool to pull out the tiny pistol. Like what? Like why is it so small? Like size doesn't matter. Does it? Any last words? Over a lifetime, there are only four or five moments that really matter. Moments when you're offered a choice. Ah, oh, so inspirational. Colossus, man of many words. Everything else falls away. Uh-huh. The way the world sees us. It's so true. The way we... Oh, uh, and, and see. <laughs> That's unfortunate because that is considered second degree murder and 15 years in prison, which can also be a life sentence, but Deadpool was fighting back here. So it is second degree that they've, they kind of got into a, a bit of a draw situation, missionary style position. So it wasn't really first degree. I mean, Francis was doing some devious shit, but every great movie has a sequel and we go into Deadpool 2. Opening line is perfect. Donde esta la biblioteca? Uh -huh. I don't bargain, pumpkin fucker. Yeah, and neither do the uh, the judges. When they hear about what you've done, Wade, it's not gonna be pretty. I thought this was an anal bleaching party. Because in this opening fight scene, Deadpool, he gets 10 years in prison for attempted murder. And when he starts to actually kill, he, he kills a lot of these guys. Yeah, it's about seven of them. Let's keep count here. Oh, <laughs> he's going really slow about it too. Like I'm surprised he hasn't been, oh my God. 
<laughs> yeah, there's gonna be a lot of blurring in this, which is fine. We also can't play Dolly Parton's song here either. But if we got that number correct, that is seven murders, which leads to seven life sentences. We can tack in burglary as well, which is an additional three years in prison. And my God, I love this scene the most. Who doesn't love big sweaty men in, in, in a spa? Donde esta la biblioteca? Ha, he said it again. Yeah, there, there's a lot of kills going on here. <laughs> and if we pay close attention, um, oh my God, there's, <laughs> holy shit. Okay, yep, that's definitely getting blurred. Uh, how many people is that by now? Yeah, by the way, this is in the super duper cut. I bought this movie a few times, actually. Oh my god, did he just teabag? Owned. Oh, if only he kicked him out the window. And <laughs> that's two. Oh, and he got all over the mask. Oh my god, it just, it gets worse and worse. Just in that spa scene alone, that is nine dudes, sweaty dudes, big uh, men guys who are most likely uncles. That's an additional nine life sentences. And it doesn't stop there. Like I said, this is still the opening to Deadpool 2. Literally, he's, <laughs> he's in someone else's casket. That is desecration of a corpse, which is one full year in prison, which makes me think. Remember that girl who was like cleaning up graves and stuff? There's gotta be a crime for that, right? She was filming it for like TikTok. Yeah, concerning. But in this funeral scene, he does end up killing four different people and that's <laughs> obviously not good we have another four years in prison and hey you know sometimes maybe you get tired of all the, the killing and mayhem and you just decide to off yourself because you're deadpool and you can't because it doesn't actually work let's get some food made but let, let, the, let the gas leak but imagine receiving 20 years in prison as well as 200k in fines for arson i mean yeah it is your own home but still he's in an apartment attached to other apartments while wearing crocs all by luck too such a beautiful, beautiful scene. Crocs just go up in smoke. But it's time for Wade to get serious, especially in the defense of his wife, Vanessa. Yeah, I mean, the way they started wasn't so moral, right? You know what I mean? But like, they're a wholesome family now, just them two. Until some fuckers decide to break in. Wade is literally trying his ass off to do what he can. He is pretty much in self-defense mode right now, which is completely fine. He has the right to kill these guys. So technically, we are not going to be counting all these kills here. Look, she's fine. Thank God. Fight! Oh no. The one dude. Oh my god. He there's no way a bullet's going that slow, right? Oh wait, no 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 Oh she braced for the impact too. At this point in time, this would not be considered self-defense if Deadpool seeks revenge on the guy who just shot Vanessa. When it comes to catching the guy, I mean he does doesn't do a pretty good job at it, but oh, when he finally does, he takes the guy by his neck embraces him in his arms and he takes himself and the dude out by ambulance i think that was an was that a fire truck or an ambulance it was too fast for me to see but still that would be considered second degree murder which can lead up to 15 years in prison i kind of understand why deadpool really loves himself some cocaine the cocaine i mean what else can you do when someone just murdered your wife but he's got that shit stashed under his floorboards okay he's in possession of controlled substances yep here yep just stuff it in baby you're absolutely right yep that is three years right there. And what do you do when you want more power? You join a team, maybe join the X-Men. Wade decides to try out as an X-Men, as a trainee. And I won't lie, he does a pretty sh job at it too. He's kind of doing it in, in a place of kindness in his heart. You know, he sees kids being hurt. Even the guy with the weird secret sex lips, it kind of feels like he deserves it, honestly. And you'll see exactly what I mean in just a second here. Put your hands behind your knees and get down on your head now. <laughs> I, I think he said that completely wrong. Once Deadpool figures out that Fire Fist here, is being abused essentially he's he's got to do something while watching this in the movies i was not expecting what's gonna happen next four or five moments i'm sorry four <laughs> or five moments doing the ugly stuff no one else will do yep in, in a split second he just ends up killing this dude dead <laughs> like what the fuck? goodbye secret sex lips rp in the chat for that that would be considered second degree murder which is 15 years in prison and those additional shots at the end where he just completely misses over and over and over this is attempted murder that is an additional 30 years in prison most important thing happens right here when deadpool gets lawfully arrested but in movies where you're taking the prison you must escape somehow deadpool and cable have a, a bit of a brawl here but they end up escaping together even though it was a bit accidental with wade pulling a fucking pin to a grenade they're out of there you're gonna get charged for that wade that is one year in prison for escaping prison and it doesn't stop there deadpool decides to create his own team the x-force you know peter's on the team 
We, we love that guy. But after the X-Force has a terrible, terrible superhero landing, Wade ends up landing and he has to finish the job by taking someone's fucking bike. This is a crime in itself. And I didn't even realize he did this until now, really. That is a pretty nice bike, but that's still considered theft. That is six months in prison. Also, it really doesn't help that Deadpool's swerving through traffic like this. He's going <laughs> going on the sidewalks. Bro, all that foul play on the scooter will be considered, uh, well, even shooting too. That would be considered uh, reckless endangerment, which is six months in prison uh oh random taxi dude just lost his job and possibly life but those gunshots he was shooting at cable that is attempted murder that's an additional 15 years in prison cable's really putting in work during the scene which i was not expecting in this convoy truck there's at least 15 felons including the juggernaut <laughs> Oh my god. Wade is still sort of responsible for this whole convoy crash. And if we want to break the fourth wall, Juggernaut in this film was voiced by Ryan Reynolds. So technically it is Deadpool's fault. Domino survived, but technically all 15 felons on board were killed. <laughs> But we do have some survivors. We got two random felons, Russell, and of course, Juggernaut. Oh my god! <laughs> Dude, it's a reaction every time. Woo! It's amazing. I thought that was you! So we need to take into account the destruction of that truck that is government property. That is a whopping 10 years in prison. With an additional um, money out of your wallet, uh, about 200K or so. The murders of all those felons on board, about 15 of them, plus Black Tom, he was on board. Oh wait, no, actually no, Black Tom was uh, killed before the crash. So we're gonna scratch Black Tom. I'm off. Regardless, that is an additional 240 years in prison. That is such a juggernaut thing to say. Oh, 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 Maybe oh, what he deserves oh, for all the crimes he's done. His penis separated from his top half. But just the fact that Deadpool doesn't die, he would just be chilling in prison. He would outlive his life sentences. And better yet, Deadpool does play a bit of time police here and ends up just murking himself. All the terrible versions of himself. It would definitely deserve. We just get rid of this guy completely. <laughs> That's one. And he did us a big favor here for taking out this Ryan Reynolds variant. Green Lantern is no more, baby. That is another kill. But those do serve as two first degree murders, which is an additional 40 years in prison. So we're gonna tally up everything for our end results. Here are the amount of fines Wade would have to pay. And here are the many, many, many years he's gonna be spending in the ice box. Listen, if you had all that time in jail to just kind of sit there and do nothing, what would you be doing? Just what, picking your nose, possibly watching a whole new chaos video. And I know I did a deep dive on Deadpool. I mean, it's kind of weird because again, he doesn't die and he's just gonna keep doing what he does, uh, killing and murking. So please, in the comments, let me know other characters or superheroes who have committed some crazy destruction or crimes that we should keep tally of to see what really happens if they were charged for their crimes. Just push the button.